me and the strawberries made it out alive they're in the back <music> Welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new. Guess where I'm going today? I'm sure you read the title already. Yes, I'm going to Aldi for the very first time. I've never been before. I heard the prices are good and we're gonna see what I pick up. I really need to get like a couple of fruits and vegetables and I wanna kinda check out what kind of snacks and stuff they have. So yeah, I'm excited. We're going to Aldi for the very first time. I'm taking you guys along with me. I got my quarter. I think I need some change or whatever for the little cart. So I got me a little quarter. But yeah, I'm about to get some breakfast right now. And then we are on the way. I want to try the 654321 method. So that's six vegetables, five fruits, four proteins, three starches two sauces or spreads and one fun thing for yourself yes i learned that on tiktok so we're gonna see if i can um make something shake with that today okay we're all trying to save money this year and my six to one grocery shopping method has continued to go viral and for good reason if you're new to the six to one method it's super super simple whenever you go grocery shopping trader joe's whole foods i don't care if you go to air wine use the six to one method you grab six veggies five fruits four proteins, three starches, two sauces or spreads, and one fun thing for yourself. This makes grocery shopping way easier, way cheaper, cheaper, and you get in and out so you're not there all day long. This has worked for me, my homies, and everybody on social media that has tried it. Give it a try and let me know how you like it. So you want to grab your veggies, your fruit, your protein, that's chicken, that's, 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 so, that's tofu, that's beef, that's anything you want, that's eggs, that's yogurt. You want to grab those starches, that's potatoes, that's rice. You get it. Try it right now and let me know you like it. Six to one method has changed my life. And yeah, I'm so excited. Let's get it. I got my little quarter because I think you need one of those. And yeah, let's go inside.
Okay, hey you guys, I'm back. So I made it out of Aldi alive. Thank God. That was definitely a mission. Like trying to record and shop, but especially trying to record and grocery shop is such a task. And I keep my grocery list on my phone. I was able to record a few clips. I didn't get a lot, but that's okay. Hopefully it's enough where you guys get the gist of it. And I'm gonna try to record um the amount of groceries I got um when I get home. I came out spending only $60, which is phenomenal for the amount of things that I purchased, in my opinion, and for the quantity. I tried to do the 654321 method. There were some things that I already had at home that I did not need to repurchase. So overall, I would rate my experience um, a 7 out of 10. Like I said, I'm a Publix girl, so it was an adjustment trying to, you know, just navigate the store and whatnot, but I did enjoy the experience. It's definitely a good place to come if you're, like, running out of something and you need to go to the store and grab it for a reasonable price definitely come to aldi um they had everything a regular grocery store would have um just not as many name brand items of course but i got majority produce and again i'll show you guys in some clips here but yeah i mean i spent 60 dollars. i got strawberries bananas apples um blueberries i got some vegetables zucchini squash um, just stuff like that. I did get some shrimp. I didn't get that much, um, like protein, I guess, if you will. Like I said, I had some things at home. Now, I do have reusable bags, um, but they're Trader Joe's brand. And I actually, like, cleaned out my trunk so I didn't have them with me. So I had to purchase, um, I only needed two of their, like, paper grocery bags, y'all. The grocery bag ripped as soon as I went to put it in the car. And I even held it from the bottom too because the handles were not getting it. So absolutely do not come and like rack up and spend a whole bunch of money and you don't have no reusable bag with you because this will break. So luckily I was able to save my strawberries. They went flying out. I lost two on the concrete. Like, oh my gosh, I should have recorded it, but I had to save the strawberries, y'all. So me and the strawberries made it out alive. They're in the back. I'm going to show you guys the rip bag. <laughs> but yeah it was definitely a good experience um i'll definitely be coming to aldi again for sure um it's probably one of those places where i'll hit multiple grocery stores so i'll come to aldi first get whatever produce i can find for a decent price and then i'll double back to Publix, which is obviously way more expensive and get the items that i was not able to find or that i didn't want to buy a lot of at one time and that's pretty much it i'm going to show you guys again what i got and i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe